welcome back to the TV1 Training Academy studio. In this short video, we'll be unboxing uh, one of our new Magenta wall plate products. Uh, in fact, we're unboxing the MG WP611-US. So let's have a look what's in the box. So uh, let's pop this open. The first thing I spot is the manual. So it's a small manual, but uh, it's got lots of information in here. So it, it has all the technical specifications, uh, everything you need to know uh, to use it and operate it, of course. It also has uh, loads of RS-232 uh, controls in the manual as well. If you want to look at any TV1 manuals ever, um, you can see them online at our website, www.tv1.com. Um, and download whatever you want. Next of all, I spot this. This is a Decora plate. So this is a Decora type device. Um, that stands for decorator. Um, be careful here because I've got some screws in, in here as well. I don't want to lose those, so I'll leave those in there. They're in a little bag, so that will be fine. Um, this is the Decora plate. Now, uh, with the Decora plate, obviously you could put your own on there. So that, that's the idea, but it comes with this aluminium or aluminum plate. Um, and, and you can see this is a real quality plate, so no, no shame in using that. Next of all, let's see what else we have in the unit. So I can spot uh, my uh, transmitter itself. This is a HD base T uh, transmitter device. Also a power supply, uh, right in the bottom, uh, some screws uh, as well. So let's have a look at the power supply to start with. So the um, power supply uh, comes with a bunch of different connectors, uh, all the, the common ones, so I can spot a US one there, EU, uh, Asian, uh, uh, you know, Far East type uh, connector, and also uh, uh, a UK as well. And you know, it's kind of a bit strange, this is a, uh, a US form factor and having a UK plug, but you know, uh, we've given you the flexibility to deploy it how you wish. This is the power supply itself, so you'll notice that it's got a locking uh, connector on the end. That plugs into the rear of the unit. Um, these are the four screws for screwing the unit in the wall. Uh, this is the important bit, of course. This is the uh, wall plate device itself. So. It's, this is the US form factor. If you have a look at our other videos, there's a, a European version as well. It's really well made. It is really solid um, uh, unit. A lovely aluminum or aluminium uh, finish. Um, let's just, just show you all the way around to start with. Uh, lots of cooling in the unit. Uh, it's obviously going to be stuck in the wall, so we want to give it some, uh, some airflow. Uh, on the back, some uh, connectivity. We'll talk about that in a minute. Uh, on the front, and I'll try to hold this nice and still. You can see we have uh, VGA and HDMI connectivity as well as audio. Um, in the middle uh, of the unit here, this is a, a small USB connector so we can update firmware. And then we also have this switch. So this can manually switch between HDMI and uh, VGA. Now, I'll tell you a little bit more about this wall plate in a moment with regards to the specs. On the rear, this is where the, the power connector plugs in, and the, these are my for connecting via 232, so I can control the unit uh, via my uh, favorite control service if I wish. Now, this unit um, is a HD base T uh, wall plate. We pair it with the HD base T receiver of your choice, but if you look in one of our future videos, we have the perfect uh, receiver that goes with this, a uh, slim uh, wool uh, version that will fit behind a, a, a screen and it will power this unit as well. Uh, HDMI, VGA and audio inputs, it switches and it also scales. So if you've got different resolutions going in, we can normalize that. Quality finish we talked about, you can see just, just by the way it looks, I mean it looks, looks gorgeous. In terms of reach, this can go 1080p up to 230 feet, that's 70 meters, or in 4K up to 130 feet, that's 40 meters. Control, we talked about already, uh, we can either manual control off the front button or RS-232 control. So that's a quick look at this. This is the MGWP611 
US. Thanks for watching. Stick with our videos. In a future video, I'll be pairing this up with its dedicated receiver and showing you it working in practice. So thanks for watching. See you soon. Bye-bye.